Hey, what is up guys? It's Brennan here and today I'm going to be showing you how to make an online store completely free and without using Shopify. So I know I make a ton of videos on the channel on Shopify tutorials and it's a great platform, but if you're looking for something a little bit more budget friendly and an online store e-commerce platform that you can start completely for free, that's what I'm showing you here in today's video. And that platform is Big Cartel. So all you need to do is go over to bigcartel.com and this is a great online store builder if you're looking to do drop shipping handmade products, digital, physical products, really whatever you want to sell. This is a great platform to get started with no upfront cost, no free trials. It is literally completely for free. I'm going to be showing you step-by-step -step in this video how to get started. Really, you can get started in under 10 minutes with your online store. So all you have to do here is go to their homepage, and then you go ahead and click open your store. As you can see here, they have a few different plans uh, with variety with more products. So if you're looking to sell more products, then you know those are the paid plans. But in this video, we're just focusing on the free plan, which you can start with five products and there's no credit card needed at all as well. So all you have to do is go ahead and click on sign up free. So that will take you right over to this page. Now I have already signed up. All you need to do is go ahead and enter your email address, password, your shop name and your shop URL, and then go ahead and click that sign up button. And once you do that, you will be then directed right over to here after you verify your email address on your big cartel account right there. You already have your online store. It really is that easy and that fast. And this is completely for free and forever free you set up your online store. So next we're gonna be showing you, you know, how to do your theme customization, testing out, do you wanna view your shop? You go ahead and click view your shop and this is the test store right here. As you can see here, we're currently in maintenance mode just because this is just a test store. I'm gonna be showing you, you know, how to do the theme customization and selection next. So as you can see here, this is sort of what the back end looks like of a big cartel with your online store. And all you need to do is then go ahead and click on edit your shop uh, design. So we're going to go ahead and click on design. As you can see here, this takes you right over to your design settings. So they have a variety of different themes that you can select from that are completely free as well. Uh, this is the Luna theme. That's the default theme on here. Uh, they have a variety of different tips and examples you can look at. And then you also have the roadie theme. Uh, which I personally like this theme quite a bit. It's nice and simple. Also, Big Cartel starts you off with a little products page and a contact page, a cart, really everything that you'd need to get started with your online store completely for free, which is really great. It, like I said, if you're looking to save money and you don't want to use other platforms that are a lot more expensive like Shopify, Big Commerce, Wix, um, you know, other platforms like that, this is a great alternative option. They also have this theme here. Uh, as you can see here, I'm going to be showing you also how to create and add your logo to the store as well. So let's go ahead and stick with the basic one. Let's just stick with Luna for now. Um, but you can go into the settings here and add like a header image. You can add a background image, slideshow. Uh, you can even edit the different colors as well. So, you know, let's just say if you want to change the background color to something a little bit more vibrant, you know, you could choose like a nice little aqua blue or something like that. We're gonna go with kind of like a nice baby blue type of setup, right? And then you go ahead and click there. And as you can see here, the background is updated uh, right on your online store right then and there. You can add different uh, fonts and everything and really customize things quite a bit. And without, you can add code, but you don't even really need to add code if you don't want to, to change out things in your store. You also have different pages, so you can add like an about page, an FAQ page, a shipping policy page as well. By default, they start you out with a contact us page, which is really nice. And then you can add these other pages easily right here uh, as well if you want to. So you can easily add things in. You just type things in like, um, you know, about us. Uh, so this store is just a test store, but we're going to be doing dog collars. So let's just say, you know, hi, welcome to my store or, you know, welcome to my uh, dog collar store, something like that. And there you can go. You can easily add pages right to your online store. Uh, whatever you want, you can add in little images, video links, anything you want. Just click done and boom, we already have a page. So, so honestly, really simple and easy to do, you know, pretty simple.
so pretty quick to edit things and another thing as well you, know, you can select the page that you're editing so if you want to see the cart page you know you can you know select things there change out things go to products so we have a sample product here. We're gonna be taking a look at adding a product as well. Another thing important to mention as well with this platform is that it is mobile optimized as well. So if you're getting traffic you know, through TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, any social media platforms, it is also mobile optimized, which is really key uh, for selling online, of course. You have tablet as well as desktop. So you have different optimizations and making sure everything looks nice. Uh, you can mouse over things, kind of make sure everything looks good, right? And we're going to go ahead and click publish uh, right now just to publish those quick changes we just made. As you can see here, it is easily added to the test store with the different backgrounds. So now we're going to be adding a logo, going ahead and creating a logo. Now, the personally, I like to use Canva. If you're just creating a simple, easy to use logo, all you do is go ahead and create an account here on Canva. Go over to logo, you can create something here. So you can see there's different templates. So we're gonna go with one of these little templates here in today's video. Um, so as you can see, uh, do we like this one or that one? Let's go ahead and do something a little simple. Let's just do this one. Uh, so create blank. So maybe that will use that one. We'll see different logo design. So you can start with a template as you can see here, we can start with this template here. So we can add text and then all we have to do, so we're gonna do, uh, actually let's go ahead and go with this one. Uh, so we're gonna do instead of photography, it's dog collars or custom dog collars. So the name is uh, BB or let's just do BB Co. So BB Co, it's um, you know dog collars. Uh, custom, custom to your pet. So there we go. And all we have to do then is click save and download. So you can click file and download. So there we go. We got the PNG. You can download that here. Boom. So we've got our little logo. All I have to do is go back to here and scroll through in the shop settings. You got your header image. So we're gonna drag it in here in the header image. So as you can see, we got our logo in the header image. As you can see, you know, if you wanted to edit things, keep your background white, then it will probably look a little bit better with this logo here. As you can see, boom, there we've got our dog collars logo and BB Co. So, you know, custom to your pet. We're going to go ahead and click publish. Boom. And now, as you can see here, your logo is there. Next, we're going to be adding a product. So to go and add it, add a product here, then all you need to do is go back to the account. So we've done that. We're going to go ahead and click exit here. And now we're on the account. Now to add a product, all you need to do is go to products, of course. You have your dashboard, right? Your main dashboard, um, which you'll need to do. go ahead and add these other aspects like shipping profiles, payment processors, uh, launching your store. These are all things you'll need to do as well uh, when you're actually publishing your store live. Like I mentioned, this is just a tutorial showing you a few things that you can do here. Now to add your product, all you have to do is click add a product. So we're going to do custom custom dog collars. Um, let me design one for your pet. And you can add categories and stuff like that too. We don't have any categories currently. We're going to make it active. And this is going to be, let's just say, $29.99 for a custom dog collar, handmade, and you can even set it to on sale. So if it's on sale, you can add additional options like colors as well. Um, so say for example, if you wanted a red collar or a black collar, and you can set various pricing depending on the options as well. You can add in your shipping details uh, as well. 
And so we're just gonna go ahead and then, well, we definitely need to add an image. Now we're just gonna be using a stock image here uh, from Unsplash. It's what I like to use for stock photos. We're just gonna go ahead and download that here as a stock photo and boom. All right, so now that we have our image, then all you have to do is click save. And now you've got your product added. And then to view the product, we're just gonna go ahead and click here on the URL. And boom, we have our product already added. And I think this looks really nice on the website here. You can see like custom dog collar product. You can select an option, whether it be red or black as well, depending on what your customer wants. So you can add in different options. And then they all they need to do is click add to cart and boom, they have your cart uh, custom dog collars added right then and there and then they can click checkout. You'll need to add, of course, your payment information as well um, to accept payments uh, through Big Cartel. You can do this with either Stripe or PayPal, and they'll walk you through every step of the way here as well as far as adding your payment processor. As you can see, you do choose PayPal or Stripe or both to begin accepting payments online or in person. So you'll need to do that as well to be able to accept payments. Um, but this is pretty much it. You know, this is the online store. As you can see, we pretty much did everything you would want in literally under 10 minutes for the basis of this video. As you can see, you go to products, you have it listed right there custom dog collars $29.99 on sale uh, and for BB code dog collars custom to your pet so it looks really nice in my opinion and big cartel really is just a great option for building out an online store completely for free really fast and you don't have to pay any monthly fees no free trial at all required so yeah definitely would recommend checking out big cartel i've done reviews on them in as well i've personally used them they are a great option you know when you're looking to get started and save money whether it be you know drop shipping handmade products um, physical digital really anything you're looking to sell online on an online store it's great for promoting your online business and getting started through you know social media promoting it and building out your online store just in a much more budget fashion and everything is really nice and easy to use as well as you can see here in today's video so guys if you enjoyed it be sure to smash that like button hit the subscribe button as well and the notification bell so you're notified whenever i upload a new video but anyway guys that's all for today's video and i'll see you in the next one peace out